Okay, guys, welcome back to the channel. Got a new addition. You saw the video of the LA, and you saw the video of the L, and I've came up with a uh, 1940 John Deere LI. I bought this from another collector. He's got a lot of the L's and the LI's and the LA's, and uh, this was kind of a overflow and extra for him. And uh, the tin was in good shape on it. That was one of the stipulations. He got to keep the wheels and the tires and the tins for his LI. He's got another uh, 1940. Anyway, I got a set of L tins. They're all in decent shape. I've got that air filter. They're all in good shape. I just got to paint them. This one does have the sickle bar. Does have the belt. There's the blade for it, the teeth. Got a bucket of goodies, all the parts for it. I am on the lookout for two L or LI rims. These are kind of crusty. It's got one good wavy lug and uh, the other one, this, is, uh, this tire's junk. It was fluid filled, as you can tell what fluid does to them. Anyway, this is the early model. I think the serial number is uh, 631538. So it's before the John Deere gave him the prefix code of LI. It's, it's still showing it's an L. It's got the Hercules uh, hand start motor or engine. I got the carburetor soaking. But you can tell how wide the front end is on the LIs versus the L and LA. There's your there's your L, and there's your LA. See how narrow the front end is? Then there's your LI. The eyes are a lot wider. I think they, they got a better stance to them. Front tires are decent. I gotta paint the rims. Like I said, I gotta find a set of rims for the back. Uh, I think that's about it. Get it all painted up and uh, get some videos of putting it back together and a video of it running. Maybe even get a video of the uh, sickle working. I haven't got this one going yet. It's next. The mag doesn't have any, uh, no fire. So I'll clean the points up in the mag. It did run when it went to storage. So it's probably just dirty points inside the mag. The LA runs great. They're getting ready to be in winter hibernation. I've got all the I got all the patios and the round fenders. They're winterized, they're ready. That one I'll probably put to use, it's not winterized yet. There's my GE, the Electrac E12. There's a Ford, there's a 332. There's my Tillin machine, a 214. And I got my little cup collection over here. Got the 100, got the 124 with the duels, got the Cub 70, got the Cub original with the wrong decal on the hood, and I've got my Cub 123 with a uh, snowblower on it. Oh, and the John Deere BO, you've seen that video. Anyway, guys, I'll get some more videos when I, uh, when I get time to start putting it back together and maybe painting it, maybe I'll show some steps, the painting process, sanding it down, getting it back together, and uh, definitely get a video of the first uh, pop of the engine. Okay, guys, till the next one.